Daddy, do you think we can save a peak? I didn't know uh, it can do. I did. I never think it's pinch. This is not a flower. Mm -hmm. It's a play doh. Uh -huh. <laughs> 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 Do I take the photo? Mommy, I'll be standing there first. Hello guys, thank you so much for popping by my channel. My name is Chef TJ and please don't forget to subscribe and to hit that notification button if you like the content. Today I just want to talk about uh, my journey leading up to this channel which is about two months old. Of course I've opened it I think long back, I think it was 2012 or something but I've never used the channel. It's only now that I became so serious. Uh, but anyway guys, I just want to talk about that journey. So what happened is that during the first hard lockdown here in South Africa, um, as you know the world was closed, it was quite but also uh, 
they, we experience a lot of uh, domestic uh, violence across the country, people fighting each other, people killing each other, and all sort of things that was happening, people were not working, there was no money, the stress and all those things. So I thought to myself, what can I do to kind of counteract that energy? I couldn't just do recipes every day because, uh, you know, we there was no funds, no one was working, there was no funds to support that initiative. Then then I say to myself, let me rather write a book that will support that initiative. And uh, here's the book, the title of the book is called Flattening the Care of, Flattening the Care of, because what I do think is that uh, absenteeism, absenteeism of fatherhood, it is a care of that, is, that needs flattening. And it is actually, in my perception, a pandemic that this world doesn't take serious. Because out of absenteeism of fatherhood, uh, that's where you will see we've got uh, 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 gender-based violence, domestic, whatever you call it, domestic violence. We've got a lot of people using drugs. We've got a lot of people uh, committing suicide, joining gangs and doing all sorts of things. And uh, in my view, absenteeism of fatherhood contributes to that profoundly. So hence I wrote the book. Now this book is basically to support the initiative to share with you guys some recipes to be able to buy and do whatever we need to do in order to support this channel. So if you if you are interested in this book, uh, I'll leave a link. I'll leave a link in the description and would really, really appreciate it. But actually, it's really an amazing book. Really, you, you'll enjoy it. Uh, thank you so much. Have a good one. So as you can see, it's now ready. It is ham. The texture is beautiful, the color, and surely the flavor is awesome. But we don't want to do that because that will make us ordinary. And we don't want that. That is our deepest fear. We want it crunchy outside. We want it crispy outside. And then inside, we want it fluffy and flazy and full of flavor. That's what we want. And that makes us extraordinary. Ah, let's see. I put it too. Can I put it to it, Dad? Just a second. Okay. Dad, you made a drip stuff. Of course, Okay guys, let us test it. But I, w I must say, even before I test, the aroma of this thing is marvelous. The texture is beautiful. As you can see, the, really, the texture is really, really good. So the texture, the color is powerful. Let us just test the um, flavor. Mm. Mm. That umami flavor from the smoke and the spices that I've put in through is fantastic i promise you i've made a lot of this recipe uh but this one by far is the best and you must must try it mm. <laughs> daddy we serve the pea